wife took the whole damn planet in the divorce. I got left in my bones. Carl Urban came in. He just was bummed. In his audition, it was uncanny. When you actually see the close-ups, you see the similarity with McCoy. God, man. It's amazing. And that's a tricky character because that's one of the funnier characters, and it's one of the ones that has the most danger of slipping into parody. Are you insane? He just brought Bones to life in a way that was this craggy, angry, sardonic, bitter, pissed off doctor, but you love him. Are you out of your fucking mind? I'm a long time fan of the show. I watched it when I was a kid. When I heard they were making a new film, uh, I was very, very interested to be a part of it. I actively went about setting meetings with people involved in the project. I think everybody was just as excited as, as I was, especially my son. We had been watching the box sets, so he was really thrilled. I'm a doctor, not a bricklayer. His bones is spot on. Damn it, man, I'm a doctor, not a physicist. I just wanted to really give a big nod to everything that DeForest had done in the past. Jim, you can't risk your life on a theory. While I did not want to become some sort of carbon copy, I wanted to try and capture the very essence of, of what Bones was. Congratulations, Jim. Now I've got no captain and no and first officer to replace him. Carl Urban is apparently incapable of taking a bad photograph. But then on top of that, he's this really quirky, really funny, a uh, really good actor. He's a great guy. The first day that we worked together, there was a chemistry there that uh, hopefully we'll, you know, we'll get to explore in the other movies. Ah! Ah, how long is it supposed to? Unbelievable.